It's been a while since we covered the step-by-step -step process of applying to a scholarship. And in today's video, we have someone who has bagged a very prestigious one. Hi, my name is Saket and today we have Ganesh with us, a Government of Ireland scholarship winner who will be taking us through his journey of winning this scholarship. But before we get into that, make sure you subscribe to our channel because it's free just like our services. Let's get started. I'm Ganesh Gite. I'm from Aurangabad, Maharashtra. And in India, I studied in Baba Sahib Ambedkar Maratwada University. And uh, I was in finance. I did my BCom from there. And okay. uh, right now, I'm in Dublin, Ireland. And mm -hmm. in Ireland, I studied at Atlantic Technological University, which is in uh, Letterkenny, northern part of Ireland. Right now, I'm working with government of Ireland. So, Government of Ireland International Education Scholarship, it's a uh, uh, like full uh, scholarship uh, for international students uh, mm -hmm. from outside European Union and UK. Mm -hmm. And uh, when I applied for, I applied for multiple universities in Ireland and then I was looking for the scholarship opportunities and then I found out about this Government of Ireland International Education Award, which sponsors your complete tuition fees plus uh, living expenses for the course of your uh, for the duration of your course so they provide 10,000 euros as your living expenses and pay off your tuition fees so it's a full award and okay. I was searching for a uh, various scholarship uh, when I found about this I applied for this scholarship and uh, within about like two to three months I got the results and I got this award I started applying for various universities right from uh, December 2022 Mm -hmm. And uh, I got admission offers from three universities by January end. And mm -hmm. uh, after getting the uh, offer letter, I applied for the scholarship in February 2021. Okay. And deadline for the scholarship was March 2021. Mm -hmm. And uh, after two, two and a half months, I received my results in the first week of June. Uh, to fill the application form, you just need uh, to fill two uh, documents. One is a uh, final admission offer letter from the university and mm -hmm. uh, then the, your references. You need to submit two references, which can okay. be academic or professional or both like one academic and one professional. So uh, I had five, seven years of experience before coming here. So mm -hmm. I did not have any like uh, much contact in my university. So I submitted both the professional uh, letter of recommendations. Yeah, so uh, process of the scholarship is uh, pretty straightforward and simple. Uh, the, you just have to apply for the scholarship by the deadline. And the only condition is you need to have conditional or final uh, admission offer from the university, which you need to upload uh, in the uh, your online application. So mm -hmm. I applied for that. You need to apply uh, before the deadline. And, mm -hmm. uh, and then that's it. Uh, they evaluate your application based on your application, the details you have furnished, admission offer letter, and uh, uh, the essay questions that you have submitted. And mm -hmm. after two and a half to three months, you get your final results. There is uh, no follow up interview or uh, no follow up okay. from the uh, yeah, department as well. So uh, I'll, I'll give you a detailed brief about the application process. So in the scholarship application, you need to fill your personal details and then your work uh, details, any extracurricular work uh, that you have done, awards and achievements that you have received. Uh, that's the first part. Second part is about your admission offer. Uh, what kind of admission offer you have uh, from how many universities you have that you need to furnish all the details there. You need to rank if you have multiple admission offers, then you need to rank your uh, like preference of universities. Mm -hmm. And third is there are three essay questions which are asked uh, like about uh, you, like uh, what is your intent of applying for this scholarship? Uh, what is your educational background and what are your future uh, plans goals plans. for this so there are these uh, three essay questions that you need to write mm -hmm. and uh, then you need to upload a letter of recommendations so right. this is the process and uh, they like the weightage wise 40% uh, weightage is to your educational background experience uh, awards achievement extracurricular work that you have done uh, then 45% uh, weightage is for the three essay questions, 15 marks right. each. 
and remaining 50% is for the letter of recommendations. Yeah, uh, for this scholarship, I will just give you like three basics of advice. One is uh, do not refer to online applications or the essay questions of the previous uh, scholars. You mm -hmm. like you do not refer to those uh, essay questions or applications. Keep your application as original uh, as your profile. Mm -hmm. Second would be keep all the information consistent across your applications, right, right. from your uh, like work experience, awards and achievements, extracurricular work. Give uh, references to uh, those uh, experiences in your essay questions and your right. future plan. So keeping the con information consistent across your application is important. And right. uh, the third would be uh, you can uh, make three applications uh, for this uh, scholarship. So okay. if you have got three uh, admission offers from the uh, universities, you can apply, uh, you, you have to apply for three times to this scholarship and each application will be assessed individually. So individually. you have got three chances uh, of getting this scholarship. So okay. try to apply for more than uh, to more than one university. So right. these are the three things. So that was for today's video. We hope this helps you with all the necessary information for you to apply for this scholarship and bring your dream of studying in Ireland to life. Before you leave, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our channel and I will see you next time.